He's got the common sense of a potato. <laughs> so right now that there, there are a bunch of nominees be in military positions who are hung up right now uh, because they, you know, we go through a process, right? You, you are vetted. They want to find out what your thinking is, what your policies are, et cetera. This is what the Senate does. And Senator Tommy Tuberville from uh, Alabama, he's a Republican, uh, he's holding up a bunch of these nominees because he believes that a lot of these people are woke, that they want to inject gender and sexuality and skin color and all the rest of it into the military. So he's trying to find out more about these people. But look how Anna Navarro goes after him for doing what we all know is the right thing. She also makes a joke here about a potato that makes no sense to me, but if any of you can figure it out, I would love to, love to know what it is. Your point about uniting against terrorism, it, it occurred to me this weekend, you know, we're, we're sending two aircraft carriers to the Middle East. There's going to be, there's about 10,000 servicemen there and women. We have Marines in, the, in Hormuz. And we have got a senator from Alabama in the U.S. Senate who is holding up over 350 appointments of admirals and generals and leaders in the military. Senator Tuberville, it is time that you stop this stupidity because we need our military leaders confirmed. Yeah. He's so aptly named Tuberville because he's got the common sense of a potato. <laughs> okay. I didn't get the joke. Whoopi didn't get the joke. I'm told that potatoes, what are you telling me now? Arts. A tuber. A potato is a stem tuber. His name is Tuberville, actually, so I mispronounced it as well. But a potato is a stem tuber. I, I don't know what that means, but, but that's, the, the, the potato joke was not the point. The point was, you see how she's connecting this. The guy's trying to stop some of the woke stuff from getting in our military. I don't, I don't know anything about these 300 some odd admirals that are, that are trying to get in, but like we do know we have a problem. But you see how the liberals, they get everything wrong, right? So Anna Navarro has basically gotten everything wrong for the last five years. Then finally she sees a burned baby and she makes sense for one day, but then the next day it immediately is now, the Republicans are bad because they're not giving us everything we want.